Welcome to Lions Draft Weekend Live. Yeah, I've been out at those joint practices all week. The Wizards have outscored the Pistons in the third quarter. Giving you all the highlights of the past week in Lions news, I'm Tori Petrie. We talked about it at the beginning of the game. It was so hot and humid out there at Lions Texans joint practices this week. Heat indexes over 100 degrees. This is the Texans solution to it. It's a temporary cooling container out on the practice field. It gets down to 25 degrees, fits 30 players at a time. Players aren't the only ones to get hot though. I had to check it out. Wow. Let me tell you, it feels good in there. A cool Tori, I center. thought you were always cool and calm though. <laughs> I try, but that cooling container really helped, guys. One of the best parts about the Rocky movies was watching how Rocky developed his plan of attack against his opponents. Before Matt Patricia can develop the Lions' plan of attack against the Eagles on Sunday, first he's got to look at who will provide the most concern for them on that Philly defense. Hey. Am I doing this right? Tom Brady sported this look going into work on Sunday, so hey, I figured I would try it myself today. Welcome back to Tori's Take presented by Priority Health. It is time for our extra point where we take you around the league. Tom Brady isn't my extra point, although he is my outfit inspiration. This humorous hero who saved kids in a Philadelphia apartment fire is. Did you encounter a team that has a renewed confidence? Yeah, most definitely, Mickey. I talked to the pair of point guards in Ish Smith and Reggie Jackson, and they talked like this team is getting into a rhythm now that they're healthy. Of course, three and one with Reggie Jackson back, but it's not just about getting his skills back on the court. It's about all of them playing together. Ish said that their chemistry isn't exactly where they want it to be yet, but it's pretty close. For me, a big moment in this game was the fact that Jamal Agnew had that kick return touchdown after being pulled last week for Danny Amendola. Huge moment for him. Matt Patricia trusting his guy at returner to get him back out there. And then he comes in big with a redemption play. We know penalties were a problem in this game, but that play in particular, there were no flags and the touchdown stood. Did you have any idea that Detroit had something like this? I did not. I did not <laughs> until like two weeks, uh, what, three weeks ago, yeah. It's a pretty cool stadium, though. I like it. I, I actually I actually kind of want to go out there. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not like, my hair is just standing up. I'm gonna, I'm gonna... You don't know how to be in a stadium and not be out yeah, there on yeah, the field. Yeah, you're right, you're right. Maybe if I was, maybe if I was up there, it'd be different, but like right now, like I kind of want to just, I don't know. <laughs> it's just an itch. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot more pieces that go into it than the casual fan might see just watching it live on television, watching it back. There's a lot of good blocks in yeah, that play. Yeah, there is. So you're on board with it. it's a Christmas movie. It's absolutely a Christmas movie. No. Disagree. No, you're saying no? It's you're, not. What's your argument for not? It is not about Christmas. It's set at Christmas. Well, he's trying to get home for Christmas, and there's a Christmas tree that he has to, like, jump over. <laughs> it's not about holiday There's Christmas themes. music in there. No, no, not, at all. not buying it. Not I'm with Tori on this one. Just a second ago, Aaron Rodgers walked by. You shook hands with him. You told him, see you in week 17. How did him not playing in this game affect it? Uh, I mean, it affected it. And I think that's a recipe for success for this Lions defense. Get some of these finger wags in here. Get some of the finger wags. Finger Get some wags? of the finger wags in there for sure. <laughs> Thanks, Mickey. Dre just got drenched over here. You're playing without Blake Griffin tonight. Where was the chemistry of this team? All right, so maybe our art museum has less steps than Philadelphia's, but it's a better art museum anyway. Maybe I'm biased. Well, our time here on Lions game plan is just about up, but the tailgate continues. It's time to toss the football. Just a couple more days till everyone else arrives. I'm Tori Petri. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you next week. I guess I got to go get the football.